something is extremely wrong with our sun. It's was into a spinning beacon of death. Many stars exit with a bang, exploding in sensible supernovas. But our sun has gone straight to changing into a neutron star, typically known as a star. You could take this as some excellent news. The sun exploding would obliterate Earth and take nearly the remainder of the system together with it. But currently that it's a star, the sun would be among the densest objects within the universe. And one in every of regarding 200, 000 pulsars within the extragalactic nebula. Shrinking itself regarding 70, 000 times the scale it want to be, our sun wouldn't be abundant larger than Apni Low Town at 10 metric linear unit, 12.5 miles, across. And it might be spinning in no time. If it's something sort of a neutron star placed within the Virgo constellation, it might build regarding 161 rotations each second. Oh, and it might conjointly shoot beams of deadly radiation directly toward the world each few seconds. Or even milliseconds. With all this radiation beaming down, you do not very have abundant time. But you'll be able to still have the time to find out a replacement language. With Speakly, you'll be able to get from ground zero to solid speaking skills in regarding three to four months. All you would like is half hour of some time daily in this impressive mobile app, out there on Automaton and iOS. You know, one in every of the items that stops Pine Tree State from learning new languages is that almost all language apps is that they teach you phrases that you'll ne'er use. And because I actually have no use for them, I forget everything I learned quickly. But Speakly is totally different. It solely teaches you what you would like to grasp in real life things. You'll learn the way to put in writing, read and, most significantly, a way to speak. Speaking has continuously been the robust one on behalf of me. If you ever needed to find out a replacement language, here's your likelihood. Click on the link below to start out your free 7 day trial of Speakly, and acquire an hour discount if you be part of the annual subscription. I did simply in time for my vacation in France. Trade Yan. Unfortunate I will not get pleasure from my new language for long. Because the world is close to get cooked. Okay, the primary factor you'd notice would be that things suddenly got heaps darker. Our sun would emit nearly no light. But you'd still be ready to catch fast glimpses of it. Though just for the very transient moment that its pulse of energy is directly in form at United States. The sun would currently be sort of a pulsing beacon at the middle of our system. This eternal darkness would cause heaps of issues back here on Earth. There would be no additional chemical process. Trees would now not be ready to manufacture gas, and crops would not grow. So, animals and humans would air the brink of mass starvation. However there would be excellent news. Astronomers have found exoplanets existing in a very pulsar's livable zone. So maybe, just maybe you'd have an opportunity to survive this. Run OJ, run. Especially as a result of the livable zone of a neutron star might be nearly as giant as a standard star. That will mean it might still be potential for liquid water to exist on surface. But this liquid water would solely be ready to exist because of our heat atmosphere, comparison energy from the sun. And whereas there would not be abundant light, there would be heaps of radiation. That's as a result of nucleon stars have unbelievably sturdy magnetic fields. This may cause beams of X-rays and gamma rays to shoot out from the sun's poles. Yeah, and this may be terribly dangerous news. All this radiation would be extremely deadly. So as to stop it from reaching the surface, our atmosphere would wish to be thicker. Maybe as thick mutually million times what it's nowadays. If you manage to pump enough air into the atmosphere to succeed in this desired thickness, you'd need to get one to living with and gas pressure as intense because the deepest elements of the ocean. It would be like happening 10 metric linear unit, 6.2 miles, to all time low of the Mariana Trench. However you wouldn't be ready to get on the brink of that depth before you'd be utterly crushed. Before you even hit the halfway purpose your eardrums would rupture and your lungs would fill with blood and collapse but you would possibly not ought to worry regarding this. As a result of Earth would not be ready to hold such a dense atmosphere in situ. The relentless radiation would simply blast it away. And if enough of the atmosphere disappeared, 
the liquid water on surface would eventually boil away, which would be the bonded death of human life on this once livable house rock.